Okay, today we are looking at just a barrel of copper. And as you can see, it's primarily just, it's just windings out of motors. And this is what I'm going to be taking in today. Now, this barrel weighs 20 pounds, and the copper within the barrel is about 400 pounds. It is 400 pounds. I weighed it myself. And all the copper basically came out of these motors and compressors and stators. So if we got 800 pounds, let's just say 800 pounds is, what, 8%? So... Wow, this might be 7,000 pounds. I hope not, because that would be a lot to put on my trailer. But this may very well be five to 7,000 pounds right here. You know, some of the motors, the actual electric motors are gonna have a higher percentage of copper. I know that they're 33% in the stators. Compressors, on the other hand, you're looking at a low percentage. So, yeah, it's probably around 5,000 pounds right here five six thousand seven thousand pounds something like that but these are the stators basically that that everything came out of so we got copper 155 gallon barrel full 400 pounds and then we got some more copper down here in this barrel we have the ends of motors which is a secondary aluminum product and it's about a third of the way full of secondary aluminum. And it's pretty heavy itself. Anyway, just thought some people might be interested to see what this load of material looks like. I've got the actual compressors around the whole outside so I could strap them and keep them on the trailer. And then in the middle I throw all the caps off the compressors and then number two prepared iron. Of course, I pick up some here and there, like there's some structural steel angle iron, I guess. And then some gas pipe over there, and gas regulators, and stuff like that. Anyway, thanks for watching.